Hi everyone, I am Pavlos. Uh, I'm the director of Birds With No Legs. So uh, Birds With No Legs is a film that uh, deals with the themes of time um, and uh, how we, we deal with it uh, as uh, individuals. Uh, it starts off with uh, us following a guy into a 24-hour uh, burger place after midnight where he encounters this woman uh, whom he finds uh, interesting and he wants to strike up a conversation with her. And uh, they go into this spiral that kind of, uh, in my head, it reminds me of uh, a, um, a relationship between two people and the back and forth questioning that goes in this relationship, uh, trying to understand each other and trying to dig deeper and deeper and deeper into the characters and... Um, find out more about them and basically when you uh, when you say something that satisfies the other person it's a it's a green light you just move ahead to ahead to the next uh, step uh, we did this project uh, through we funded it uh, through uh, Kickstarter um, uh, doing a crowdfunding campaign uh, it was a project I really wanted to get going i really want to get it out there get it out of my system basically uh, so i decided to go the route of um, doing a crowdfunding uh, getting all the friends and family aboard and um, and uh, make this film more about me um i may uh i make a living out of uh, doing uh, tv commercials i'm uh, i'm from greece i live uh, i share my life between uh, london and uh, athens and i work in uh, tv commercials advertising and um on uh, my off time i try to do projects uh, such as uh, films or uh, other uh, media projects my main influences um, are, uh, well, a huge influence for this film is uh, obviously uh, Wong Kar Wai. Uh, the title of the film comes, uh, and some lines that the main character says comes from um, his uh, film uh, Days of Being Wild. Uh, and uh, it's uh, it's really inspired from, from his take on this kind of, it's not magical realism, but it's, his films just sort of have this essence, this poetic essence in mundane and and everyday life, and uh, which I really love. And um, uh, yeah, I'm heavily influenced uh, from 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 him, and uh, also um, Charlie Kaufman. Um, I think the box, the the, the story behind. Um, my main character uh, is inspired also from uh, Charlie Kaufman's film uh, Synecdoche in New York, like the way that what, what would he want to, to achieve basically is in that film and the way that uh, Philip Seymour Hoffman's character in uh, um, uh, Synecdoche in New York works kind of like is what's inside the head of my main character. Currently, I'm working on. Uh, well, I'm, I'm still trying to figure out how I'm going to put some ideas together for a feature film that I have in my head. And uh, at the same time, I'm working on a um, on a on a climate change uh, project, which is kind of like a virtual reality project. That you, you put, but it's not using VR. It's basically putting the audience inside the space and. Um, it uh, recently got funded uh, in Greece to to start, and hopefully it's going to make rounds around uh, Europe in the future, maybe. Um, should we succeed in that? Uh, we're just uh, uh, full speed uh, working on that right now. That was it. Uh, thank you so much for having me at the um, uh, REN Film Festival. And... Um, I surely do hope uh, I can make it and be there with you. I love the film festival at, uh, atmosphere and um, yeah, it's, it should be great. Thank you so much for having me on board. I really appreciate it. Thank you.